Hi, this is Sarah. I'm going to give you a quick reading. So this will be the feminine energy today. And the rider weight will be the masculine. definitely determining her life path right now, going within, uh, deciding what her next move is, keeping to herself a lot with the hermit and the history right here. She, um, she doesn't mind being alone. I see that she actually thrives in that energy. She loves uh, creating. She's working on a creative project alone right now. She's definitely balancing some, some different connections energetically, but um, this is kind of who she is. It's like she thrives in that energy. Um, and then there's an ending to that, kind of like the cycle of that in the past where she was doing that is like ending. With the judgment here, it's like karma as well for keeping a couple people uh, maybe on her. Well, you know what that looks like. Like they're, they're not the ones in control of the situation. <laughs> they don't want to be. Um, and she's following her heart. She's moving past that and following her heart, choosing the... Even if it looks like a you know more dark route, she's going that way because her heart's leading her that way. To have launched, she's making a choice. So I feel she's choosing one of those like lovers, and she wants to have a baby with that person. It keeps coming up, baby. Um, she feels a little bit insecure where she's like living right now, or her situation right now. Um, so that's why again she's going within, keeping to herself, uh, avoiding like the storm outside, staying only with people that uh, she really trusts. A lot of consistent green energy here. Um, she knows someone's coming to talk to her, to um, passion, express passion toward her. Um, that's why, so she's, again, this is like so echoed with this card and this card, like there's clearly a storm outside and she's safe and protected. Her angels are protecting her. This card's sort of here, uh, she's staying focused, right? Like rain, we see rain in this image. She's gonna be safe, she's fine. People are actually giving her things, like helping her, giving her money, you know. There's all this, right? Like, this is just like loudly echoed. It's like, yo, like in case you didn't know, this storm is a metaphor for the spiritual warfare that's going down right now. Um, but she's like ready to battle, like look at her. You think she looks scared? Nah, no. She even has these animal friends that are helping her. You know, she's very connected with nature. She's, she's gonna have this new beginning in love. This is unconditional love and it's not going anywhere. It's always there. And that's the reason that's behind this. It's the reason behind this. It's why she's fighting, fighting for love. Thank you. Oh my gosh, look at it. She's ending the things before to choose love. Like that's, and that's the card of two cups. Powerful energy, honestly. Like she's, love wins. That's, that's the message here. Okay, so that's her message. It's very, very strong energy. And then we have him. Focused very much on finances, just from that shuffle I saw. Um, wanting to return to her and give her something, but first needing to end something in order to do that. But look at how he's like marching through town, not caring like who dies, who has, he has to leave behind, you know, like what they're, the person doesn't care. They do feel like a lot of hard work is uh, still to come. They're still in a sort of player energy. They're working on that though. That's like something they're stressing about. That's what's making them feel stuck. And they're having a lot of strength as they move past that kind of past energy in which they were dealing with this queen of swords, someone who is very brash. Um, they're being a little deceptive in this escape. Um, it's not quite the death card yet where it's like he doesn't care who sees him march through town with this flag of like, or like pride, I guess. But um, no, right now he's being like a little sneaky about it. Um, but soon he's gonna get, he's gonna match this like person's energy in a way and like they're gonna be very uh, blunt with each other, very honest about this situation, the secrets about how they were juggling others and you know, it's all gonna come out. Every, the truth always comes out. And it's gonna lead to this tower moment, obviously. Uh, you can't keep these kind of illusions up forever, and especially when there's this potential. So this has happened like divine intervention to get uh, him back on his divine path. 
and that's literally like destiny, destiny. Um, so yeah, he's gonna go forward in a very slow way to give something to his feminine energy. A big blessing is coming in for him. This is the emperor, of course. He's in his power now. He remembers who he is now and he's ready to have this new beginning, the fool. I love ending the reading on this.